So this is a synthesized uh, uh, action here. I'll demonstrate to show certain principles of Tai Chi. The moves are very small and they are difficult to detect, so I will explain. When we do this move here, the first thing is we are pulling the elbow actually in towards the Dantian like this. So the elbow is trying to do this. But this is only an individual move. While doing this here, the shoulder cannot move, it can rotate. That causes the hand to be pulled. But the hand is locked this way, it cannot be pulled back. So you create a stretch on your forearm that throw the hands, throws the hand actually out. While doing this here, to compensate, the claw goes forward to support the elbow, forward and upward like this. When it does that, it tried to move the body like this. Then you lock the elbow, that forward move causes the elbow to, the shoulder, it causes this move, causes this to go downward. And when that happens, the rear claw turns this way, but downward. The front claw turns this way, but upward. It's this way and this way. And all of these are tied together with the center, never going sideways or up and down. So this is the core directions and uh, instructions and the rules that the body parts must follow for six sealing and four closing. Totally stationary. Then later on we can add moves like this here. And then we can add a certain part to create more movement. And you see this is only adoption. There's no power. The power is when the hand reaches a certain position, the elbow kicks, kicks into action. 